Good morning, guys. Um, today's Saturday morning. It's right at seven o'clock. I was a little tired, so I slept in some more. I was gonna get up at six, but anyway, it's about forty-eight degrees. Not too cold, but it got chilly last night. Uh, today the plan is to head uh, south in California and see what we can reach but anyway time to get up a lot of fog around time to go brush my teeth get a couple of things I think I'm gonna get me some bananas Maybe some bagels. Alright, today we're starting at 136,194. Um, it's still really uh, foggy. I have to be careful driving because there's so, uh, so much fog around. But, gonna get on the road. This is what it looks like driving on this fog. It's pretty thick, so I'm driving nice and slow. Quick little update, guys. We driving for a little while already. Thank goodness that the fog is way better. Right now we're really close to Bakersfield, uh, which is where I stayed like what two days ago or something. And there it looked like this. I just finished gassing up. Um, now we're in Bakersfield and we have about two hours, a little over two hours to go. Uh, the goal is to get to Pacific Coast Highway uh, and if I can find something good to eat around there that will probably give me something to eat there so I had a banana and I'm gonna have a little um, granola bar to hold me over all right guys so it's time to get on the road getting there around one which will be perfect because I'll be really hungry by then and I'll find a place to give me something to eat This is Ventura, California. I haven't seen the, the water with my eyes, but navigation is telling me that it's right there. It's supposed to be right over there, but I can't see it. Hopefully soon. It's Saturday, um, 12.50, almost 1 o'clock. And look at the traffic. Man. If 
people walking on the fields out there. At least the weather is nice, but that's hard work. There is the water. <laughs> so cool. Very cool. Guys, thank God I made it. I'm in one of the beaches over here. Let's see if I can get down. There's the water. There's Project Little Taco. And there's people with RVs and, 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 and vehicles parked. I saw them alongside over there. Pretty cool. to touch the water. Because I'm pretty hungry, so I decided to grab me something to eat and I want something typical. So I asked a local what they would recommend, and they suggested this place, Lalo's. It's in Ventura, California. So let's see if I can get me something to eat. I'll let you guys know how it turns out. There's so much stuff. That they want a burrito. I think I'm gonna go for this one, the California burrito. We have a lot of stuff. Well, guys, this is the burrito. I ended up getting a California one. Oh, yeah, that looks like it's a good size. Definitely a good size. God, just just took a bite and it's really, really good. 
I mean really good. Wow. The rice is nice and moist. You can totally taste the chicken. It's good stuff. The hot sauce is a little bit on the hot side, but that's good stuff. Wow. 100% recommended. <clears throat> I'm going to continue eating. I'm not going to finish the whole thing. Probably going to eat half and save the rest for later on. Man, this is good stuff. Well, guys, <clears throat> this is what I ate. This will be a nice, nice little, um, either for later to, uh, today or for tomorrow. This thing actually has french fries on it. Very, very filling, even though I was really, really hungry. I think I might have a churro just to try it out. Well, guys, I couldn't help myself. I really wanted to try a churro from California, so I ordered me one. It was two dollars and fifty cents. By the way, guys, so you guys can have an idea. A regular bottled soda here is three dollars and twenty-five cents. I'm like, wow. People must make a lot more money here than they do in Florida. But let's let's try this out. That is really good. Really nice and fresh. That's good stuff. Wow. I'm gonna get eating, eating this one and then hit the road. I think I wanna go and see Santa Barbara and it's pretty close by. And then decide what I'm gonna do. Well, guys, that burrito was really good. Definitely, definitely recommend it. Great place. And that. And the um, churro was just like freshly made, it's very crispy. It wasn't like it was sitting around, sitting on anything like that. So definitely recommend the place. Very, very good. Made it to Santa Barbara. Looks like a really cool little town. But I have to say, this makes me think that I'm in Spanish country somewhere. The architecture is totally Spanish. Even this little plaza here in the middle. The clay tiles, everything. The arches. Pretty cool. It's 3.30 over here. Yeah, nice little E30 convertible over there. For those of you that are into cars. Back in the day in New York, they used to call those cars yuppie cars. Because only the people that were like the business world could afford them or had them. Pretty cool. There's little taco. We drive around a little bit. And then I'm gonna head back to see if I can find a Walmart. This is beautiful though. Really, really nice.
electric bike. Place where I parked. Uh, people are supposed to can only stay for about 15 minutes. So I cannot walk around very much. Just want to take a quick look. This is a really nice place. Wow. Casa de la Guerra. This looks like it's old. This is a museum. Very cool. Wow. Very cool. I parked my little truck over there. Very cool. Look at the tile. This is like the old school tile. It's bigger than the new clay roofs nowadays. Very cool. So I just talked to the guard over there and he told me that all of this over here was someone's private house. It's supposed to be huge. It was like a mansion and it was from the early 1900s. That's amazing. Supposedly when this was house was here, there was nothing else. So the owner of the house could see all the way to the water, to the sea. That's amazing. And now it's a museum. Wow. Okay. We've got one for next season for the electric. Very cool. There is a ton of RVs, all kinds, little ones, big ones, big motorhomes. <laughs> 